Hi, this is Tracy HD, and I want to thank you for joining me today for a daily angel guidance message. As I shuffle the deck, I'm asking all light beings, angels, and God, please relay the message I need to share with my viewers, the highest good of all. And I will take the top card. And the top card is card number 39. And it says, the time of guilt and shame ends now. Forgive yourself and begin to love yourself just as you are. And oh my goodness, what a beautiful and powerful message that is. Okay, we're all unique individuals. Okay, we all have something to contribute. And this card is telling you that you have done something wrong, or you may have made a wrong decision, or allowed your you know, emotions to lead you astray, but you now have the inner greatness, the self-awareness and ability to be true to yourself, to recognize this. But have you also asked for forgiveness? Whatever is weighing you down in your past or present, whatever makes you feel sad, small, or bad, whatever you're remorseful about, now is the time to transform it. Mistakes are made so we can mature, so we can learn from them and grow. The time has now come to forgive yourself. You've drawn this card because you've been feeling remorse or even shame, perhaps only recently or for some time. However, it's okay. You've recognized it and you're sorry, so forgive yourself so that you can return to your soul path and continue on cheerfully and with a light heart. Begin to love yourself just as you are with all your weaknesses and strengths. The more you accept yourself and acknowledge every side of your nature, the more complete and fulfilled you will be. Get rid of all your emotional baggage, show yourself kindness and mercy, and start to love yourself completely from now on. This love will then lead you to new dimensions. Conduct a small forgiveness ritual. The time has come to release all feelings of guilt and shame. The darkness never stops spinning its web in an attempt to catch and paralyze us, spreading its base vibrations and wearing them around us and ensnaring us. Recognize this and free yourself from this web. Humility and repentance are good, but do not become trapped in them. And you know, we've all been there. Think of it this way. You did the best you could with what you knew at the time. You did the best you could with what you had. So don't beat yourself up over it. Forgive yourself for not knowing better in a situation because like I said, we've all been there. That's how we learn. And this card is associated with the number three. Uh, the healing crystal is the pearl. And the herbal essential oil is damask rose, and the power animal is a jay. Beautiful message. If you've enjoyed this reading, please like it by giving it a thumbs up, share it, and above all, subscribe, because I will be back with more.